hi guys it's a uh, 76 celtic moon and little froggy we've been away for a while but we are back to let you know what we have been up to uh, it's been a while since we've been here but we're going to show you um a haul and what we've been into and some of our new things we're into and stuff like that first thing i want to go over is this awesome Stampy plate. It's by a P. A, oh, I do not want to butcher the name. A P A P I P I L A. Apila. Apapila. Apapila. See, I'm Spanish and I don't know that word. That, that's thank you, Philip. That's just sad that I am Mexican and I cannot pronounce that word. My mom and grandma would so Apapila. Apapila. <laughs> it's number seven, but <clears throat> it's got all these beautiful Philip. All these beautiful different designs. It's got these swirls and these yeah, flowers. These, and it's kind of dirty because we were and testing skull. it. Yes, the, this big, this is a huge sugar skull. So, But it's got all these little itty bitty little designs inside it because there's no way you can fit all that on the nail. But it's got these swirls, these little fans here. Hang on, we'll go through those in just a second, Philip. These flowers here, little clocks. And then you do it to the side. See the big old star here, little stars. All kinds of awesome goodness. And I have a bunch of swatches on these nails over here that we did do some of. I will show you guys in just a minute. But this is the biggest one I've got so far. Um, I can't remember offhand the dimensions of this one, and I don't have my ruler next to me. I think it's on my desk. Can you go check my desk real quick, Philip? My yeah, desk for the like for the red thing. ruler. It was on the floor. Sorry, guys. The kids just got home from school and they're. Going back and forth, you know, and there's a butterfly right here. It's a pretty butterfly. Um, and inside the butterfly, it's got all these little swirls and stuff. And I'm sorry, about the glare. Okay, let's see. It is. It is 13 and a half centimeters wide. You cut it. By 19 and a half centimeters in length. So that's what's that for? That's the. Uh, I know you're not gonna eat all that. The. Uh, that one is number seven. Um, it's pretty flexible. Does it arms? <laughs> hi guys, it's uh, 76 Celtic Moon and Little Froggy. Say hi. Hello. We're here to go over some new things that we have been up to in the past few months since we've been MIA. Um, sorry we haven't been around. We've been busy with... Um, the loss of our family member and whatnot, and me working, and just just life in general. But we are back, and uh, I know I posted a video about a month ago that we're back, but we're really back now. But we want to go over some new things that we are into right now and enjoying very much. And that's my puppy. So the first thing I want to go over is this enormous stamping plate that I got. Um, I got it out of a group a group by. Uh, a stamping group that I'm on Facebook. Uh, one of the ladies was selling it and I bought it. It is um, a pila. A papila. You guys, I'm butchering the name and I'm sorry. Apapila. Oh, hang on, let's try. Apapila. Yeah, see, see, Phyllis more Mexican than I am. That's just sad that I can't say it. Anyway, the, um, the length of it is, I mean, the width of it is... 13 and a half centimeters see in length and width excuse me and the length is children 19 and a half so this is a huge plate this is almost the size you know like half the size of a sheet of, of notebook paper we'll go over those in just a second anyway it's got all these lovely designs on it it's got these swirls here and it's got you know all kinds of, it's a little dirty because we were swatching. And it's got some stars, lovely stars, that's a big star right there. Um, all kinds of little dots and swirls and flowers with the vines. And that one there, I'm sorry for the glare, guys. These little swirls, it's got little butterflies here, and see, flowers here. And a skull. Yeah, and the big skull, but we haven't gotten to the big skull. You've got some big swirls here. But it's just, you know, the flowers. I know, see, see, there's the big swirl there. So, see, that design, see, yeah. Anyway, that's, that's this one right here, see. 
that we did. We were swatching a whole bunch trying to see what would work, what wouldn't work. And I did find some polishes at Walmart, actually, that actually do step over black pretty decently. But I'm still looking to get the uh, Mundo de Unas soon. There's a big old butterfly, and that's huge. It's got all these little itty-bitty little things in there. Got some more flowers and some more of these, which is exactly like these, but they're opposite, like mirrored, reversed. And then, of course, my favorite one is the big old skull, which you won't be able to fit that on. Oh, you see, sorry, there's um, clocks and stuff like that. But the big old skull, you're not going to fit that on a uh, nail. Um, but it's got all these little itty-bitty designs inside the skull, which, you know, are... Probably the cam canvas. Oop, yeah, but you got to get a stamper big enough to pick it up because my uh, creative stamper won't even pick it up. See, and it's pretty big, and it gets maybe half of that. So maybe if I stamp it like twice, like half here, half there, yeah. I can stamp it onto a thing, but you got to line it up just perfectly. But that's one other thing I'm going to go over pretty soon, too, is all the stampers I've got. But that's my um Apapila plate. Apapila. If I say it wrong, I am sorry, and Philip's trying to help me. He's getting aggravated with me. Apapila. Pila. Okay, the next oh. ones we're going to go over is Philip wants to show his Angry Bird one. And I'll do some swatches of some of these plates too. But this is a QA17. I'm not, I, again, I got this off of a lady, off of a uh, stamping group that I was in. And it's got all the little Angry Birds. Okay? The next one. The next one is a Q Girl. I forgot I had this. And it's got butterflies. Here, Q Girl 13. And it's got some butterflies. Now let's see. Let's see if we can get the zoom. Focus. There we go. Some leaves, some flowers, some butterflies. And there's that one. Next one's by E19. Uh, hang, on, hang on, hang on, hang on. We don't want to mix, some, mix the collections together. Oh. See, these ones are this one. Yeah. Uh, what's the rest of these? That's it. Did you make some? Oh, right there. Uh-oh. We're missing some. Oh, they're there. Uh, Winstonias. Okay, the next ones we're going to go over are these Winstonia plates. And this is, um, this is, what is this one, Philip? The Winstonia ones we have here are second generation. There's the little box that came in. Second generation. We're missing a plate, but I don't know where it went. It's, well, actually, no, I'm not. Here we go. This is the first one. It's got some squares and stuff like that. You know, so there's that one. Second one, W202 has these. It's got the little hearts. And, I love this one. Hang on a second. <gasps> there's a the little heart. And see, there's kind of what I did with the hearts right there. See how the hearts are right there and how it is right there. So that's how I did that. And I'll tell you guys later how I did the uh, the multicolors. It's actually not... Yeah, I'll show you how to do that later. There's that one in there. There's a little bee. We've got a bee somewhere over here. Where's our bee at? I don't see our bee. We had a bee on here, but I can't find it. But I'll show you guys those in just a little bit. Okay, and then these little things here. So that's number two. Number three is what I had on my nails last week, which is these here and <laughs> these here. Really, Mama? You guys, I'm recording. See, they found one of my plates that I didn't want them to find, but it's okay. And they're giggling because it's funny. Boys, can I have that plate, please? <laughs> See, this is what happens when Philip tries to help me with plates, and I will show you guys this bad plate in just a second. And <laughs> they're sitting here laughing because they think it's funny. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Quiet. Can I say it? No. Just um, let me finish this. Okay. We got this here, wood grain, <laughs> some little zigzags, a telephone here, uh, an hourglass here. I'll do that plate after this plate, okay, you guys? Okay. And then this one, we have a bunch of other different little designs. This is Damn, almost like a... my favorite. Like a... um. Different plant like tire tracks and squares and this here. This one here is what I have on my nails now. Well, one of them. I have these on my nails. Yep. Yeah, see, see, Philip's like, see, yep, yep. 
Um, the, this is pretty much what I use for my Valentine nails that I have. I, have, I used one of these and then I used a Salon Express, I believe. Where is the other plate at? No, it's a circle one like this, honey. Salon Express. Anyway, we're missing it. It no, must have no, fell on the ground. No. It must have been the one that fell on the ground. No, Phillips just mixed it with these two, that's all. Okay, I use this design for my nails here, and I've also used this Salon Express one right here, right here, which is this nail here. This nail and, let's see, let's see. I alternated them, see, this nail and, and this one, and I've also used this one too, which is also, where's that? We can't find it. What? Oh, sorry, see, Phil found it. And then this one too, see. You just laid it down, I'm like right there. See, it's kind of, there you go. Anyway, anyway, off track. Anyway, this is number seven, but this, well, like I said, this is what we use for our Valentine nails. Don't knock that over, please. That's my favorite. <laughs> then we have number eight, which has got some uh, furry stuff on it. Okay, we have the, the moon and the stars. We have um, um, a, toad, a toadstool. We have fairies. We have this little thing here, more fairies, and some more little things here. Um, the next one is number 209, and it's like the, uh, circus type thing. So we got a circus tent top. We've got the, um, jumping through the hoop. We got fair. We got the dolphin. Not dolphin, the seal. We got balloons. We got a carousel. And we got a little clown juggling, um, juggling. Um, the next one is number 210. And we've got a koala bear, kangaroo, a fox, a flamingo, a raccoon, and a dolphin. I'm trying to get these to show to where it's not glare. So, next one is one of my favorites. is a fiesta. And we got the, the chili peppers right here. We got my favorite sugar skulls here. And then you got a regular skull here. You got the little... Mexican people dancing with the maracas, and then of course a little banner right here. It's a really good plate, and here, Philip. This one is number 212, and this is like an Easter one because it's got all these cute little uh, opposite, hold on, opposite chickies. We have a butterfly wing here, little um, flowers here, a bunny here. This is like a little um, a design you would do for eggs and stuff, you know, that's pretty there. This one is opposite of that one. There's that. Really pretty. This one here is number 213. And it's an Indian theme, which is lovely because, yeah, we got the uh, dream catchers here, here, a teepee here, an Indian with a bow here, some arrows here, a little axe here, a little, the little hand right there. Next is 214. And this is like a salon based thingy here. We got the saloon. We got the little the little cowboy here. Cowboy boots with the spurs. A cactus. This here. The little wanted sign. And then of course this little thing right there. I'm having a brain fart, so don't mind me. Okay. This one is like a castle type princess type theme. Hi, Philip. We got the little chandelier here. We've got the crowns here, some candles here, some swords, a castle, a little teapot, a little night hat, and a little bigger castle. But, yeah. Philip is speaking dolphin, he says. This one is a disco theme. All right, we got disco, the little, disco, little squares. Disco, <laughs> we got disco, the dancing disco, girl disco. here. Disco ball here. Disco ball here. Little swirls here, which I have on a nail somewhere over here. Yeah, here. Little swirls. I'll show you. Little swirls. See? Swirls. All right. Next one we have is number 217. And we've got like octopus here, unicorn here, pigs flying. See, when they say when pigs fly, when there you go. When pigs fly, people. See, there's a pig flying right there. I'll be like, okay, when pigs fly, look at my nails. 
Anyway, we have a genie and a lamp right so there. I'm like, that ain't a pig flying. That's a pig flying on nails. <laughs> you see, there's this little thing here, unicorn. And looks like a little yin yang. But yeah, there's that one. Number 218. We have windmills. We have rooster on a weather vane. We have a fence. We have some tulips. All these are all in all really beautiful plates. Go pour me some more of that, please. Okay. This one is 219. It is a big old thing here. And then these little dolls here. This little London um, thing here. Go make some more, please. Little car. And that there. Number 220. We got some dinosaurs. Roar! <laughs> so we got some waterfall here, and you got the looks like a volcano erupting here. And Everybody then we got the ice age, run. dinosaurs. Listen to Philip and pterodactyls. A little bit of ice in there, please. Number 221 is like a Halloween type theme. You got a pumpkin, you got little ghost faces, or uh, pumpkin faces, excuse me, a pumpkin ghost here. Faces. Witch in a cauldron here, um, a web here, a little Grim Reaper here, and then this little thing here. It looks like, you know, monster teeth, but it also kind of looks like, like a candy corn type thing, but I just kind of, and then this image right here. The last one in this set is a Christmas one, which is really pretty. You got this little thing here, you got the little snowflakes, you got the Christmas tree, you got the, like the, um, the sweater sweater print one, gingerbreads, little mittens, you got these whole holiday ornaments, and then you got the wreath. That is it of my Winstonia Generation 2 collection. There's like 22 in a thing. I paid on Amazon $12.99 for them. I went back, back uh, I paid $12.99 for this set on Amazon. Uh, I just happened to go on there yesterday to look at these things, look at um, the other Winstonian ones they had on Amazon. These went back up to $17.99. So, uh, yeah. So, I paid $12. So, I think it was like $15 altogether with shipping and everything. But I also bought a, a, a stamper with them, too. So, it cost me like $20 for, you know, the set. So, okay. On to the next, um, the next set of plates. We're going to go... Okay, this one I'm going to show you is what the boys were giggling over a little while ago when you guys heard them over there giggling like hyenas. Any moment now, Donna. <laughs> Donna. All right. Donna, I got Donna, this as a gag. Donna, uh, Donna, 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 as a gag Donna, 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 gift type thing because one of my friends, she... Uh, actually, I have a few friends that do, like, adult parties and stuff like that. So, I thought this would be a cool little gag gift for them. So, this is what I got. And, children, if you are under 18 and you are watching my video, please turn the video off. If this is offending you, I am sorry, but I thought it was kind of cool. And, I don't need to go into explanation about what this is. A lot of us are adults and we know what this is. <laughs> so, I give for your friends. <laughs> so, that was that one. You don't watch if you're under okay. 18. Okay, and of course, I have some. If you didn't hear me, a gift for your friends. You hear Philip. Some Salon Express uh, plates. You know, you've all seen these. I have these, too, because it's what I use, or what I was using. Um, one of these. I don't know what these are. I remember where I got these, but it says B30, and I know it's not Bundle Monster or nothing like that. It's just, you know, and they're, yeah. They don't have no backing on them or anything. Can I have that plate, please? One of Philip's favorite plates that he wants to give to Lily is this one here. Of course, we know why. Oh, I got to go back my too. Okay. And we've got some some lips here, a Betty Boop, see, there's the lips, there's the Betty Boop here. Some of these didn't turn out pretty good because like here, when I got the plate, that is missing some of the in image. It's not really etched real well, So, but I only paid like $2 for this plate. Then we got the Betty Boop here and the Betty Boop sign, the Betty Boop on the um, hold on the dog and some little hearts which there's the hearts 
See, it comes out pretty good, but some of them are just, you know, not etched properly and it just didn't come out right. So, and of course, I only got a couple Hello Kitties on here. This plate is uh, majorly uh, Betty Boop, so, but we got some Hello Kitties, you know, Tiamo, which means I love you. And all these other things. Take them outside, please. Now we have another um, a square holiday plate. I'm not sure where this one come from. Like I said, I got a bunch of my plates from a uh, um, a nail stamping plate swap type thingy. I'm just cleaning it and drying it off a little bit. You guys can see it okay. There we go. And we have some presents. We have a Feliz Navidad. We have a snowman. We have a Christmas tree. We have Santa Claus, we have snowflakes, ho, ho, ho. snowflakes, candy cane, another Santa, a jingle bell. Can you get him on his lead, please? Jingle bells, jingle bells. So, like, there's two little kitties right here. Look like a little Hello Kitty right there, you know. Meow. Got two cats here. Meow. This Hello, one, everybody. I'm Hello Kitty. These are pumpkins. We have a skull creature here, a ghost, an owl, and it looks like a little girl in the witch's thing with a, uh, a butterfly. <laughs> So there's those plates. I have more. I have four more to show you guys. Plus I got some more coming in the mail. I ordered some plates from Sissy and Sissy. Sissy. Um, I tried to order the GoGo only, Google only ones. But when I went last week, they had it. When I went yesterday, it was unavailable. So I'm very sad about that. This next one I'm going to go over is the Fairy Tale Collection by Moo London. And it is this one here. Very beautiful. One of my faves. And then on the back of it, I took one of the other plates that I purchased that's a knockoff and just glued it on there. And it's just, you know, the little different masks and stuff. So I paid like $3 for this one. And I paid 7 for this one. But yeah, it's got all these little stars and the fairies and stuff like that. And little, little um mushrooms and yeah it's very beautiful and I like it a lot the last three I'm going to go over are from Mary Ann I believe Mary Ann yeah Mary Ann Nails they came in these little black sleeve thingies and this is like an Asian theme you got all these Asian girls and different little things, these fans, these dragons, yin yangs, um, stuff like that. And this is Marianne Nails number 32. Can I do that? That's just the Maybe. And that's the first one we got. The second one we got is like an Egyptian team thing type thing. And there's all that. Last one we have, we have um, these here. So, and this is um, number 14. So, this is like another Asian type thing, or a, yeah. So, there's that. So, we're going to go over something real quickly. Um, my stampers, I have, let me show you what I got real quick. Because I have a Quite a bit of them. <laughs> Hold on, Philip. Give me that one. Thank you. What else we got, honey? That's it. Okay. Now on to the stampers real quick and then I will cut this off and upload another one because I'm going on almost 25 minutes. I didn't realize it would take that long to do this, but I am sorry. The first stamper I ever got was this Salon Express and it's, you know, double-sided. It came from Walmart. It was like, what, $10? The, the head is very firm, non-squishy, and it's just, yeah, okay, it works. But, yeah. Then I had one of these. I actually have three of these. Hang on, fellow. And this one is a squishy firm. See, squishy firm. And it's got that little bit top there. This one is more of a marshmallowy squishy. See? 
and it's a little dirty, so yeah. And then red top there. This one here is basically a refill head. This is like a candy head, and it's really squishy. See how squishy that is? Squishy! And red hair there. And this one here is an extra seat. This is a squishy fern. This one I don't like at all. If anyone has any of these particular kinds that are not hard as a rock like that, that wants to sell them, get rid of them, whatever, let me know. Or let me know where to go get one. I've seen the one with Donia. And what else? And then I have this little yellow one. And it's really, really, really squishy and really, really, really sticky. Look at that. See? Yeah. This is the one. Uh-oh. This is the one that came with the Salon Express. And it's kind of hard, so not too good. Lastly, my favorite one that I got is the one from the Creative Shop. And you can tell from this one to this one, the size difference. Uh, and fill it. It's 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 kind of like a squishy firm, but it's also really, really sticky, and it's really, really big. The next video I'm going to do, I'm going to do some swatches of some of these plates for you guys and show you guys size comparison and picture comparison, you know, of the things. And I got this from an online store that sells them to the uh, United States. It, I ordered it, and it I think I took two weeks after that to order it. Right now, it's out of stock and on back order so I will definitely be going back and I did decorate it because you know I needed something to grip onto because it was just a regular solid silver uh thing and it was hard to where'd you get those things to get it I got them at Dollar General for like 30 cents these? the stickers yeah you then of course songs. then of course there's all these little scrapers and whatnot that I have you know but I use this which is the create yep see we got look at all these folks trying to show us look at all these scrapers we have all these scrapers. Including the credit card. And including mommy's broke credit card. So, yeah. Because that's what I was using for a while. Because I don't, I can't, don't use this purple one here. Because of that metal right there. Because, yeah. So that would like to, and then we got the little credit card thingy. You don't need this, you know, like that. And I'll show you in the next video if you want. See, I got extra of these. I'll just get rid of those. And tape them together. No, that's how they came. One of those. See, those two that are taped together. See, all these, all these things that I have. It's a bell. It looks like a bell, doesn't it? See, Phillips says it looks like a bell. Sorry, 27 minutes, you guys. I'm sorry. But, um, hope you guys like this video. Um, stay tuned for the next video. We're gonna do some, I'm gonna uh, end it with Tetris. Yeah, Phillips gonna end the, end the video with Tetris. You know, so, and, um, hang on. End it with Tetris, and we're gonna, um, yeah. Let's go. He's so happy, you guys, to be back. And like I said, and this is what I store my my plate, my things in, and this is where I store my.